Happy full moon, everyone. Tomorrow is the full moon in Aquarius. Oh, my goodness. So, what stokes your creative fires within you? What kind of things really get you excited about life? You really need to be focusing and looking at your best life, just like I was talking about yesterday. What does your best life look like? What does it feel like? Who's in it? Who's not in it? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Who's not in that best life? What isn't in that best life? What is in it? Mm -hmm. Figuring out the things that are best for you, that bring out the best in you, is so key. It's so important. Also, making sure you're paying attention to what brings out the worst in you. Have you ever... Oh, I can so relate to this because one person comes to mind and the person never ever did anything to me ever but there was something about this person that it was a friend of of my second husband we all grew up together and and it was you know he was a mutual friend to his whole family and they all hung out together but there was this one person i could not stand to even hear his name he never did anything bad to me. Never. But, oh, it, it brought out the absolute worst in me. I couldn't stand to be around him. And, like, if he showed up, we were all hanging out, and he showed up. Dear Lord, just let me not say anything ugly. Let me not say anything ugly. <laughs> Who can relate to that one, right? Who knows why? Maybe we had some past life beef together. Who knows? I'll never know. But I never... Oh, it just made me a different person. Like a monster in me came out whenever I even heard his name. And for absolutely no reason. But it's something to pay attention to, right? That's huge. Because there was something. Something wasn't right whether it was something that carried on from a past life or it was something in this life that I just knew something was going to go amiss or whatever at some point with that person in all of our lives. I don't know. And um, that was many, many years ago. Who knows where that person is now? Don't care. Don't even want to look. Ugh. Ugh. It still makes me crazy. <laughs> but paying attention to those things. What do the people around you that are actually in your life, what do they bring out of you? Are they bringing the worst out in you or are they bringing the best out in you? Some people we will have to decide that we're going to love from a distance because they're just not good for us. It doesn't mean we hate them. It doesn't mean that they're not a good person. It just means that they bring out the worst in us and that we are not good around that person. Some people bring out the absolute best in us. They they make a smile and they bring the sunshine out. I have a good friend of mine that reached out to me just last week. Um, he had had some, some crazy dreams. Of, so, of course, who does he run to? Oh, he says, I need help figuring out what this dream was about and what these other things are going on in my life, what they're about. He had a lot of heightened senses and, and things, and his dreams were really being extra, a whole lot extra. So... Um, I remember when I started my previous job, he was one of those people and he came in and he would say, you know those people that when you see them instantly, they make your day better? I said, yeah. And he said, you're one of those people. <laughs> that is wonderful. That's like <laughs> one of the nicest things anyone could ever say, right? Because I think a lot of us want to be that. If more people looked for the sunshine and looked for the good rather than focusing on being uh, those who spread gossip and lies and those people with jealousy, you know, and stuff like that, that, that don't want to see you living your best life. They only want to see themselves living their best life. And that means tearing your life apart. Then so be it. Yeah, we need less of that and more of those people that bring sunshine into our lives. They just bring the joy and the happiness, right? So we need to pay attention and pay attention to, you know, your your work. What is what part of your job brings out the best in you 
And what part of your job brings out the worst in you? And how can you make changes there so that you are doing more of your best and less of your worst? There's a lot of things to consider. A lot of things. Oh my goodness, got me all emotional. But, um, so pay attention to those things. This full moon is going to highlight a lot of the things that have recently come into our lives from the last new moon a couple of weeks ago. And those things are going to be spotlighted and, 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 the, and they're going to be seen in a way that we see their value. We see where this is going and we see how abundantly blessed we are to have these new things, whatever it may be for you. This new thing that's come into your life, it's going to change your life in ways that you never expected Be ready for more abundance all year long to flood into your life because it's on the way. I know things in the world still seem a little crazy, but we're getting there. Have a great day, everyone. And remember, you have the power to create the life you've always dreamed of. You do. Get outside, touch the earth, cleanse your space, do your meditations. And remember this, Wyatt, the Wolf, the Raven, and Spirit, we're sending you unconditional love. Mwah.